Namaste. Welcome to my next video after quite a while. Uh, I have been myself through a challenging time for myself, physically and mentally. And now I'm back feeling well again. And today I would like to talk to you about gratitude and how to have gratitude for all the good things we have in our life. And as I mentioned, uh, I had been feeling not so well. And so I can understand that in these times it's not so easy to find gratitude and appreciate what we have. And it's hard sometimes to see the good things when you are overwhelmed uh, by all the hard things coming to your life and so it's even more important in these times to to realize that no matter what is happening there are always good things in our life and that everything after all is about the attitude and what we focus on and what we give attention and our thoughts to so it's very important that we realize what really matters and that we can find time ideally every day like a very short time but I believe that when we do it regularly it's even more effective ideally in the morning or just before you go to bed if you do it in the morning you just set the day in the right vibrations the vibration of gratitude is in my opinion one of the best vibrations you can give to yourself and to your environment so once you wake up you give yourself even like two minutes just to realize what is good in your life maybe the fact that you wake up next to the person you love and who loves you and then just this huge things actually you may take for granted after a while or years being together you should realize every single day that this is a blessing. This is not everybody has and some people will never do. Some people are very lonely and it's it's sad. So you should be very grateful for that. And if you have kids and they are healthy, they are alive, it's another huge reason to be grateful for your family, for your friends for the people who support you, maybe your colleagues even at work, who are just nice people and help you and you know you can rely on them. Or the fact that you have a job and that you can live the life you want to live, that you have enough food, that you have a bed to sleep in, which is dry, clean and comfortable. There are still many people who don't have that and we see it as something so normal that we don't think about it and the fact that many of us can live quite quite freely and can decide what to do there are still countries where people are not so free so this is another reason why to feel gratitude or even the fact that you have some free time that you can devote something some time for yourself for your good health physical and mental, that you have this opportunity to devote time to yourself, to your well-being. It's very important as well. And just find, I would say, really ideally every day, time to be quiet, to be in a peaceful place. Like me, now I'm in a park, in a city which is not the best city because it's very noisy. I don't like the cars uh, there at all. Um, so I come to this park to find some quiet time, some time in nature. Because that's uh, so, so healing and so beneficial for us to be in a quiet, peaceful place, ideally in nature. So just find a few minutes every day when you sit down, maybe even close your eyes and just, just be. Not think about all the things you have done and you think you should have done differently or all the things which are waiting for you and you feel like it's too much. Just be and be peaceful. 
and be grateful that you can be a little bit quiet. And that can be your time for gratitude. Sit down and think of, let's say, three things which you are grateful for in your life. Or even something you are looking forward to and you are grateful that you can do that. And I believe if you find or give yourself the time for gratitude time, it will be beneficial for you and bring some more peace and joy in your life. I hope this can motivate you to do some little things which will improve your life.